In this video, we'll see how to create snippets in your Visual Studio Code. So what are snippets? Let's say you have, no, this is a next application that I have at hand right now. And here is a page.psx file. So here, if I type in something called, let's say, um, client public file paths, and I click here, and pressing enter, this thing gets imported, right? So this like it's like a shortcut to create some custom code so right now i have something called like whenever i create a page i need some default code on click of a button so i'll just create a snippet for this thing so in order to create a snippet i'll go to preference configure snippets and i'll go to the new global snippet file and type in create next page and press enter so that creates this kind of file in this particular directory so in order to create a snippet i'll just uncomment this portion of the code i'll modify the name to create next.js page i'll add a prefix now prefix is something that i'll be typing in to print the default code so i'll name it create next page cnp and the scope will be since i'm using typescript react i'll type in typescript react inside the body i'll remove the existing code from here i'll paste that sample code here and i'll put this in quotes put everything in quotes now once that's done yeah we also need a comma here it would be easier if i had a shortcut instead of typing this thing so there you go i'll just remove these also and type in slash t for this thing that should be good i'll just save this thing and let's just try this thing out i also modified the description let's go to the page.tsx i'll just type in cnp you can see here this thing comes in snippet to create an xjs page i just click on this thing and that creates the default code so now whenever i create a next page all i need to do is type in the snippet code or the snippet prefix cnp press enter that will get created now one thing here this page this this name you can configure this thing to be modified so every time i type in what comes in is graph page instead I just add dollar which will be page name I'll just copy this thing come here similarly here also I'll just save this thing go to my page.tsx file remove the existing one type in cnp and you can see I'm getting page name there and a cursor so I can press backspace the name goes away and i can type in graph page and you see the change reflects on all the three spaces right on the three places so that's how you can create snippets in your vs code so now so i hope you like this video do let me know your thoughts in the comments below thanks for watching